Verse 8. Verse 9. Then Saul, which is also called Paul, filled with the Holy Ghost, set his eyes on him. So, first he found, if you want to lose the bands of wickedness, first you must find. Then second, you must be filled with the Holy Ghost. So the first F is found. The second F is filled. Because if you are not filled with the Holy Ghost and you attempt an action, you will hear some words you don't like. Jesus I know and Paul I know. But you, who are you? So he found, after finding, he was filled with the Holy Ghost. I pray that the next time a server of food comes around you and the person is demonized, may you be filled with the Holy Ghost. I remember one day I went somewhere and I was eating with my very good friend, Reverend Steve Mensah. We were eating. I think Bomi was at the table on that day. A lady passed. I told Steve, I said, this woman is a witch. Pastor Steve went, <laughs> I said, oh, Steve, oh, baby. Me, who know about, oh, baby. The woman came and put food down, put food down, put food down. When she attempted going behind me, the power of God hit her pipe. She flew with her plate and her tray, everything on the ground. I looked at Steve like this and I went. I told you. But you know what? You must be filled with the Holy Ghost to know some things and say some things. From today, may you be filled with the Holy Ghost. Witches will be uncomfortable around you. Principality, oh, the next time you get into Kekena Pep, the driver who is a wizard will jump down from his own Kekena Pep and run and leave you with the Kekena Pep. You can take it to your house, park it there, and call him to come for it later. Come on, if you are shouting, that is your blast. Some people can serve you with water. And after that, you become a drunkard forever. Oh, and the Lord is telling me. <laughs> and when I just said that, the Lord just told me, that is how Jesus turned water into wine. And the devil has got the counterfeit. And today, May you be filled with the Holy Ghost. May you be filled with the Holy Ghost. I said, may you be filled with the Holy Ghost. Listen, there are some kind of women you sleep with them and finish, you never recover. You should, you should be filled with the Holy Ghost and say, get out of this place in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Listen, it is not for nothing that God wanted people, male or female, to be virgins until they marry. And that's because you know what, sometimes eh, you can fornicate and it's just flesh to flesh and you will escape. But sometimes it can be spiritual exchange. Just like some people can go and fornicate and it's HIV and they get it. Others, there's no HIV, so they escape. In the same way, you can go and I grow in a moody and a moody and so on. But I wouldn't be here. I could die. Hey! You will struggle for many, many years. But the many years ended tonight. Because today where I'm standing, anything I bind on earth will be bound in heaven. And anything I lose on earth will be loose in heaven. Anybody that is shouting, the word of God has come to you. In the name of the Lord Jesus. <laughs>